Metasub sample kit contains a package of sterile swabs, barcoded tubes, and powder-free gloves. When you're ready to sample, take out a sterile swab and make sure you also have a barcoded tube ready. What you're first going to do is open the sterile swab from the back end away from the swab head and prepare to remove your swab. Then you're going to take your barcoded tube and make sure there's fluid inside and slowly unscrew the cap without touching the inside of the tube or disturbing the fluid. You're then going to remove your swab and gently dip the swab inside the tube so that the swab is wet but not damp and dripping and then slowly take the swab out and return the cap to the barcoded tube. Once you t are done doing that, you can take your barcoded tube and store it in a secure location until, until you're ready to deposit the swab end inside. So now you're ready to swab your surface. Once you have a surface to swab, you're going to look at your surface, make sure you have a good area, and apply a downward pressure at a 45 degree angle and swab across diagonally and back and forth until you cover the entire area. You're going to want to twist gently as you do this. You don't want to press down too hard or you may actually snap the swab. You're going to do this for approximately 180 seconds and when you're done, you're going to take your swab and then prepare your barcoded tube. As you can see, the swab has a small indentation where you're actually going to snap the end of the swab inside the barcoded tube, which I'll show here. So you're going to gently insert your swab and then snap it off twist it a little bit and you can discard this end and then carefully put the cap on as so. As you can see the swab head is now inside the tube and if you, you have completed one sample. If you are double swabbing meaning you are using two swabs on a single surface and you are completing the 180 seconds while holding the, both the swabs you will deposit one swab head into one barcoded tube and the other swab head into another barcoded tube. Now I'm going to demonstrate a negative control. Uh, so in order to start a negative control, you're going to take a single swab, open it from the back end, prepare to remove your swab, prepare your barcoded tube and remove the cap, take your swab, dip it into the fluid within the barcoded tube and remove it. And put your cap back on the tube. And then you're simply going to hold your swab out away from you for 180 seconds. You can have someone else time this for you or you can simply count. And then once you are done, you're going to take it. And just as if you were performing an experimental uh, sample, you're going to take your swab and snap it off into your tube. Close it. And again, make sure to mark down the barcode. And then you have completed one negative control. Thank you for participating in Global City Sampling Day this year. Please be safe and see you next year.